Hey, what's up, Chomp Squad? And welcome back to another Chomp Vlog. I'm not even in it, because I just got home. I'm annoyed. So today I wasn't gonna vlog, I just hung out with my mom. Guys, about two months ago, I filmed a cleaning my closet video, and I was like just going through my closet, donating and stuff, and because it wasn't like a sit down video, you know, it was just like me. Um, one night I was just cleaning out my closets and I filmed it. So I just went, oh my god, I forgot about this video. So I uploaded the clips. Because it had been so long, when I go and delete my clips after I'm done filming and posting like for my regular videos I guess I just kept deleting here and there of these clips so I gave away so many clothes and I wanted to film me donating to help encourage you guys donate and stuff the video can't happen now so I'm just gonna show you what I have on here I have way too much stuff I always just like give to Value Village and I know it's good because they do support charities but I have been like trying to research different um, like women's shelters lately because I have a lot of like makeup like not even used makeup that you know like I get from like companies like StyleCon and different things like that and just from PR I just feel like the things that I don't want why would I keep them when there's like worthwhile products and women's shelters I was googling it like there's different websites like 12 things to donate for women's shelters makeup and nail polish and cosmetics books, feminine hygiene products, like a bunch of these things that I have and that could, you know, help people. Like there's a whole other aspect of it in, you know, shelter and food and necessities and stuff. But there's also another side of it. I have a bunch of stuff that I'm not using and that could make somebody feel beautiful. So why not do that, right? For some reason, I just keep piling up makeup. Who knows why? Like my makeup collection is so nice and organized and then there's like this. So I don't even use lashes anymore. Well, I just haven't used it. So we're going to give it away. This Bite Beauty, I've never used either little brushes like why why do I have those over there I don't need them what's this oh my god look at that brush here is our donation bag now Woo! welcome to my closet uh -uh. costume it's not Halloween anymore and when Halloween comes around I'll probably buy another one instead it's so cute but it like is ripped I bought it like that too people be like why didn't you return it well it was in a different country so I didn't realize so I got home uh, these are just leggings and they look really weird on me so I don't need those you must not know about me I like more like hello I'm wearing a bikini and a push-up bra like that's that's my look oh this is a neck deal put it over your neck like oh, daddy this is so ugly Ew. Uh, say a lot to my little friend. Look at this top. Like I'm literally an ice skater. Ooh, this is my bodysuit that says Wahane. I gotta wear this more. This is such a sick outfit. Or it says 99, not 100, because I'm not quite there. Okay, Dalton also gave away a ton of his old clothes too. And a lot of you guys have suggested the Salvation Army because they go to good use and the Interval House. Um, and the lighthouse. So I think I'm going to kind of split up my donations. And again, I'm not trying to be like, oh, look at me. I donate. Oh my God. And, uh, I'm just trying to like make a positive impact because there's some shitty videos on YouTube. You know what I mean? And this is just what I do in my life. So hello, this is my life. <laughs> I had a friend, you guys, in high school that whenever she had clothing that she didn't like anymore, she would just throw away, like, in the garbage. In the garbage! Someone else can love it. I haven't even worn this yet. Okay, didn't know it was in there. This one says gangsta. Have you guys seen that uh, trending Alex Trebek Jeopardy thing with gangsta? The guy's like, gangster's paradise by Coolio, and he's like, correct. And then they were like, oh, by the way, like, way after, like, after he got it right, they were like, you don't get that one right because you said gangster's paradise and it's gangsta. <laughs> hey. Nobody needs this much clothes. Like, I don't. My shelves are just happy. And I'm giving back. You guys, I suggest you do this. <laughs> Purge all my clothes. Yeah, there you guys go. Donate, okay? Give back. Hi, I'm gonna show you what I bought today at the mall, okay? I'm also gonna brighten up this blonde right away because it's looking like orangey. Ooh, what is this, you ask? It's a cat tail. <laughs> it's explicit. <laughs> Kephora. It's the Kat Von D Powder Locket Foundation. I used this to set my foundation and I ran out, so I got a new one in like 40, 42. I got a concealer at MAC. It looks like this. It also looks like this. And I put it on my under eyes and blend it in. It's an NC15. <laughs> what if all my hauls were like this? I went to David's tea. Cause literally all my teas expired. And I know you can use tea for a long time, but 
it's been too long, you know? I gotta throw away my tea. So I just got, you know, a few because I'm addicted to buying tea. It's so fun that I buy too much and it's like five people's lifetime supply what I have in my cupboard. So like, there's no way to drink all of it. So this is like my whole tea collection right now. It is though. Yeah, it is. Okay, this is my favorite tea from David's Tea. It's the Buddha's Blend. Heaven can't wait. Me on my deathbed. <laughs> it's really good. It smells so good. My favorite one of all time is the Monk's Blend and they took that away and put Buddha's Blend. I'm like... And then I got a variety pack of their sweet indulgence. Satisfy your sweet tooth. 12, wait, 12? 4, 4... A 12. I'm mad. And there is toasted walnut, chocolate macaroon, strawberry rhubarb parfait, eh, midnight summer's dream, English toffee, alpine punch, forever nuts, so good, uh, cardamom French toast, coconut cream pie, hot chocolate, banana nut bread, and movie night. I feel like cardamom French toast, like I'm Bobby Flay. And then the girl recommended this because I was really bitching that they took away Monk's Blend, so she's like, this is like it. Zeph, you weren't even there. You weren't there though, how would you know? I'm not even attempting to pronounce that. And I went back to Urban Planet. Cause I went there if you saw in my haul. And I couldn't stop thinking about these sandals like to wear for the summer. <laughs> oh, what did you hear that? Like to wear for the summer. <laughs> they're so sparkly and they're just like super classy with my mustache. It's $19.99 and then when you buy another item it's $5. So I bought these for 20 and they're so cute. They just feel like the summer or even the spring when there's snow is, when the snow's gone, I thought they're just cute. So the item I got for five bucks was originally $12.99. Like this is, this is a top. <laughs> My boyfriend's gonna be really happy, me leaving a house like this. <laughs> like here's the back, it looks like that. Got it. Now for the dreaded part. Garbage, garbage, garbage. Oh. <laughs> Actually there wasn't that much. Oh, what's this? All around me are familiar faces. These are literally just filters, so there's no tea. It actually looks super classy in there now, and there's so much more room for activities and crumbs. <laughs> That's where we keep the toaster usually, but I was just too lazy to put it away this morning, so it's here. Did I break something? You are beautiful in every single way. Yes, work. Can I bring you down? Oh, oh, oh. oh, don't you bring me down today, young girl? Don't cry. I'll be right here when your world starts to fall. I am obsessed with Christina Aguilera today. We stand a queen. Ah! Happy Easter, everybody. We're choosing the squad comment. The squad comment is L X L L Y. Oh, can you please do the shopping challenge where you buy each other's clothes? <gasps> That's really ironic because we are actually planning that in the near future. Yes, we want to do that probably this week coming up. That's Either this we week do. or next week, but yes. because we have one other thing planned, I'm not going to say anything else. When the trend was big, uh, we wanted to do it and then stuff happened and we were like, oh, we can't film here. And then you had to leave for work and then this, 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 this. So we just haven't done it. And that makes me happy because I was like, should we still do it? Because will people still watch it? So. That makes me happy. We're gonna go to sleep now. It's like 2 a.m. and we gotta wake up early. <laughs> Good night. Goodbye.